my understanding of uh, next generation access or uh, super fast broadband is taking us from where we are today, which is some people are on dial up, some people are on slow broadband, some people are on faster broadband, to a place where everybody is on broadband of 50 or 100 megabits, uh, which will really transform the way most people use the web. As broadband speeds improve and are made available to more people, there'll be more opportunities for folks to uh, take their work wherever they want to, um, to use higher bandwidth uh, online services, uh, be that video conferencing, consumption of video for entertainment or for work purposes, or just more intense uh, data processing and manipulation through software as a service and cloud-based uh, computer applications. In Google, uh, one of our markets is Korea, where there is pretty ubiquitous high-speed broadband available to all consumers. And as a result of that, we've been able to make our Google homepage uh, more rich in terms of graphic content without slowing down its delivery to users, um, particularly important in that market due to the complexity of the, the character set. So it shows that as broadband speed increase, uh, companies like Google and others can change the way they uh, service their offering to users. In terms of the cloud computing applications that are out there, uh, some of them are more basic because of the limitations of today's browsers. Um, but we'll see a couple of things going on. Firstly, we'll see more and more adoption of the more uh, sophisticated browsers uh, and those using HTML5, which is a new generation of browser technology allowing far more uh, processing within uh, the internet browser. That will allow applications to offer much richer functionality um, over, over the web uh, and through um, high-speed broadband. And that will allow people to uh, develop web-based applications which can do pretty much anything uh, in a very short space of time in the future that can be done today by desk-based applications. Over the past years, our lives have become much more cluttered by gadgets and media and technology. And I think there's an opportunity with Superfast Broadband to declutter our lives a great deal. So where in the past you needed to have your whole collection of music on CD or your favorite videos on DVD, all of that can be outsourced to somebody else. Somebody else can manage the ownership of those things and you just uh, rent uh, those as and when you need them. And that enables you to have far greater choice but without the clutter in your life of having to decide up front what to own, what to keep, what to, uh, what to store. Back in the 19th century, many companies, as they adopted electricity to transform their businesses, had vice presidents of electricity. They had a department to try and manage this new thing that was going to be uh, something transformational in their organization. Later on in the 20th century, many businesses had a, a department in charge of managing the generators that would make sure their business would continue to run if the power grid went down. Now that's pretty much gone. So now businesses just rely on the fact that the electricity comes in the hole in the wall and their business can run on that basis. The internet is like that now. So businesses now have a hole in the wall where the internet comes in. They can rely on it being there all the time. They can manage uh, the fact that the stuff that comes in through that pipe can be uh, hosted up in the clouds and they can rely on the data, the video, the applications coming into their business in a reliable way. And so I think for businesses of the future, they won't have a web department or they won't have an online strategy. It will just be the strategy of the business. It will just be the way they do things. And I think it's reliant on the fact that they and their customers and their suppliers and their partners are all connected to this super fast, ubiquitous broadband internet. Uh, we'll get there soon and it will really transform the way businesses work.